Hello everyone and welcome back to a new tutorial. In this tutorial I'm gonna be showing you how to get the how to make how to fix the jump upgrade. I mean the uh, speed upgrade that we made. So you're gonna fix the upgrade shop and get it to work. So instead of uh, your player added event, we're gonna create a folder, so local upgrades is equal to instance.new and folder and we're gonna parent it to the player and upgrades dot name is equal to upgrades and in here we're gonna create a end value for our speed upgrade so local speed upgrade is equal to instance dot new end value comma and we're gonna parent it to the upgrades folder drop line and speed upgrade dot value is equal to zero uh, zero and speed upgrade dot name is equal to speed upgrade make sure you spell everything correctly like I did and you want to scroll all the way down and you remove whatever is after this and until you reach it you then and all you have to do now is to just put and player dot speed dot uh, upgrades upgrades did we rename it to upgrades or upgrade yes upgrades so player dot upgrades dot speed upgrade dot value is less than max slot then and in here you want to do player dot leader stats dot gems dot value minus equal to price and in here you want to do player dot lead dot uh, upgrades dot speed upgrade dot value plus equal to one and in here what we're going to be doing is inside of our main screen main uh, screen gui inside of your upgrades frame or actually before we do this we're gonna go ahead and play the game and i'm also going to just disable the loading screen for now just to test this quickly and if you go here and for some reason uh, the jam display thing is not working but we'll fix this so we can upgrade it to one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and we can't upgrade it again so we have a limit and what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to make sure to convert to actually fix this uh, GY right here so I'm going to go to my main script or just select this and I'm going to go here and I think yes I gotta change this to gems and uh, that should fix the gems display and all we have to do now is inside of our upgrades frame i'm going to change the its position back to zero and i want to make sure that this is converted to scale so just scale this up or however you want and i'm going to go to plugins unit conversion and convert it to scale and now I'm going to make sure that this is same size as that this is a square and I'm just going to change the position back to where we left it so let's just change this back to minus one so what we're gonna do now is instead of your slots label instead of the speed upgrade uh, frame we're gonna add a variable for the player so local plr is equal to game dot players dot local player 
and in here we'll put a while loop so while to do put a wait and we're gonna do script dot parent dot text is equal to player plr dot upgrades 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 dot speed upgrade dot value dot dot slash dot dot and we're gonna put script dot parent dot parent dot uh, max upgrade dot value and i think that should fix our problem but before we do that inside of your main script in here you want to remove this run service thing and if you go ahead and play the game now, I think it should work perfectly fine. So let's go ahead and join the game and see how this looks. Okay, so we're loaded and as you can see, this is fixed. And if we go here, and we upgrade this, it does work. All we have to do now is to add some feedback. So we just gotta find a nice sound. Let's go to here. Let's go to audio and let's go to purchase. Or let's just search for buy. And I'm just going to insert this and put it inside of the SFX folder. In replicated storage so sfx for sound effects and we'll go to our main scripts and if result is equal equal to bot then game dot replicated storage dot sfx dot buy colon play and now if you go ahead and play the game it should play the buy sound so we're loaded uh, and if you go here and upgrade this a couple of times as you can see it does play the sound and it looks pretty good so in the next tutorial we're going to be adding saving to the upgrades and also adding uh, uh, more upgrades and yeah if this helped make sure to subscribe like the video share it with your friends and i will see you all in the next video bye